Hello guys, Miss John H123 here, and I'm just letting you know, well, I've started to go on the South Park games, Stick of Truth and the Fraction Butthole. So, uh, it's been a while since I've played these games. Uh, South Park Stick of Truth, I did just struggle a bit, but only because the uh, first time I played it. But I've played it a lot, a lot of times now, so I should be, I should be all right with it. Fraction Butthole, didn't get a chance to complete because I had problems with it. But uh, yeah guys, I'm going to do it anyway. Even if I struggle, I struggle. It's still good, I guess. <laughs> uh, I, was, I, I was doing uh, Witcher 3 Wild Hunt, but that messed up badly, so I had to delete it all. Some technical issues. But hopefully I'll be back in the future. With most of the other games I've got, I've still lots, lots more games to sort out and put on, put on YouTube. So, yeah, guys, I hope you enjoy this, guys. Uh, please like and subscribe to my channel, enjoy the video, and carry on watching, guys. Stay tuned, and I'll see you later. in the lands of Zara. The humans of Koopa Keep struggle to stay alive as they are attacked by the wicked drought elves of Larnia. Darkness falls as the humans beg their king to save them, a noble king known only as the Grand Wizard. For a thousand years, the battle has been waged with only the bravery of the Grand Wizard to protect his human followers. But even though the Wizard King is so undeniably cool, the drought elf armies continue their attacks. They seek the human's most treasured relic, the Stick of Truth. But the tides of war soon to change, as news of a new kid spreads throughout the land. In order to save the humans, the Grand Wizard must get to the new kid, before the Drow Elves can manipulate his man and use him to take the sacred relic from human hands. For whomever controls the stick, controls the universe. Well, I think that's everything. We did it, hun. We're really moved in. It's a new beginning for us. Things are finally going to be good. Do you really think it will be better for him? They won't look for him here. We just need to make sure he doesn't attract any attention. Come on, let's see how he's doing. Sweetie, hun, you all dressed? Hey, champ. How do you like your new room? I know it's a big change for all of us, but, son, do you remember why we moved to this quiet little mountain town? He doesn't remember. He doesn't remember at all. That's good. That's good he doesn't remember. Uh, sweetie, we want you to have lots of fun here. Why don't you go out and make some friends? Right. Get outside and play, son. Like, 
like normal kids. We've got some money for you on the kitchen counter, sweetie. Just be back before it gets dark. Yeah, we love you too. Go on outside, sweetie. Come on, son. Get out there. Make friends. Mom! Thanks, kid. I didn't realize he had a health potion. But my name is Butters the Merciful. I'm a paladin. I live right next door to you. We should be friends. You should speak with the Wizard King. He's been talking about your arrival. The wizard lives this way, in the greenhouse, over there. Hey, where are you from? Where'd you live before moving here? Oh, hail the Grand Wizard! So, you are the new kid. Your coming was foretold by Coldwell Banker. I am the Wizard King. But the time for talk is not now. Let me show you my kingdom. Oh, who's your new friend, Eric? Shut up, Mom. Not now. Welcome to the kingdom of Koopa Keep. Thank you. 
Our weapon shop here is tended by Clyde, a level 14 warrior. Here you can see our massive stables, overseen by the level 9 ranger, Scott Malkinson, who has the power of diabetes. And here, of course, is the breathtaking and lovely Princess Kinney, the fairest maiden in all the kingdom. Don't ask why Kinney wanted to be a chick, it's just how he seems to be rolling right now. Is as incurable as my hey, where the hell are you is. going? You may have heard of my deeds at the Battle of Stark's Pod. You have been sought out, new kid, because humans everywhere are in great danger. I need something from you, and in return, I am prepared to allow you into my kingdom. I know you are very excited. It's time for your first quest, but first, please tell us thy name. You entered Douchebag, is that correct? Are you sure you want to keep the name Douchebag? Very well, Douchebag. You will now choose a class. Fighter, Mage, Thief, or Jew. A mage is a... You look sneaky. A mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. You look sneaky enough to be a thief. A Jew from New Jersey. So you're basically Cow's mom. Cool. You look sneaky enough to be a thief. A mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. A fighter has courage, honor, and the ability to kick fucking ass. A mage is like a wizard, only not as cool. A fighter has courage, honor, and the ability to kick fucking ass. We welcome to our kingdom, Douchebag the Fighter. Hooray! Now please, go and visit the weapon shop. Procure yourself a weapon and we shall teach you to fight. Would you like to see my wares, weary traveler? Perhaps you would like to hear... Ah, a lovely purchase. You have procured a weapon, Ness. It's now time to teach you how to fight. I want you to take your new weapon and, with the bravery of a noble knight, beat up Clyde. What? Kick Clyde's ass, new kid. what I do? I'm the king, Clyde, and the king wishes to be amused. Go on, new kid, kick his ass. I'm gonna kick your ass. Clyde, you have to wait your turn. That's lame. No, Clyde, it's like olden times. You have to wait your turn. Like in the Middle Ages, Clyde. I know it's lame, Clyde, but that's how we're fucking doing it. All right, douchebag, bash Clyde's face in. Don't be shy. Suck it. <laughs> that all you got? Oh my god, it's butters all over again. Okay, look, try putting your back into it at the last possible moment. Ah! <sighs> try again. Focus right before you strike. Oh, hell yeah, Clyde's your bitch. All right, Clyde's wearing armor. In order to hurt him, I want you to hit Clyde as hard as you can. Ah. Oh, shit, dude, I think I see blood. Fucking nice, bro. It's exactly what you do to guys with armor like that. Okay, listen up. The key to surviving in battle is not to get hit in the bouts. Clyde, it's your turn to attack. Douchebag, protect your bouts. Prepare yourself. Yeah. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. Dude, you're already way better than Clyde. All right, it's time to use your heroic powers. Using your ability takes power points, or PP for short. <laughs> PP. 
If you have a fucking better name for them, then fucking say it, Clyde. Fucking asshole. I'm the king, and I say it PP. Douchebag, use your fighter ability to make Clyde pay for insulting the king. I dodged that. Way to wipe that smile off his stupid face, douchebag. Now do it one more time. Finish him. What? I was going easy. Take this. Worthy, douchebag. Now come inside the war tent and I shall let you see the relic. Douchebag, I ordered you into the war tent, douchebag. Well, here it is. The reason why humans and elves are locked in a never-ending war. The relic for which human and elf are willing to die. The Stick of Truth. Just two days ago, we took the stick back from the elves. Our kingdom was dying, but now it thrives. For whoever controls the stick controls the universe. Don't gaze at it too long, for its power is too much for mere mortals to look at. Now that you have seen the Stick of Truth, let's discuss your dues. Being a member of my kingdom costs $9.95 for the first week, $4 of which is tax deductible. Alarm! 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 Someone has sounded the alarm! 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 What is it? The elves are attacking! Oh my god! Defensive positions! Man the gate! Don't let them through! Give us the stick, humans! Fuck you, Drow Elf! Come and get it! Clyde! Guard the stick of truth while we defend the fortress! Aye, aye! Aye, aye! We're not playing pirates, Clyde! Douchebag, this is your chance to prove yourself. Hold off the asshole elves at all costs! Me, me! Ah. Ah. Do it, douchebag! Kick these elves' asses! In your face! You're wounded, douchebag! Potions will heal you! Here! Rules say you can have one potion every turn. I asked for five, but this was a compromise. This guy's fast, douchebag. Try to block all his attacks. <laughs> okay, if you block all the attacks, you get a counterattack. Look at your enemy on the ground. Weak and helpless. Kick the shit out of him. Awesome, you kicked his helpless ass. Now finish off these elves in the name of the Wizard King. Douchebag! That wasn't very nice. Oh, hamburgers! Yeah. Butters, you're losing! Stop! Oh. You got this, douchebag! Suck my balls! <laughs> uh. What are you waiting for, douchebag? That guy's just standing there. Go kick his ass! Oh, man, he was totally waiting for you, dude. You can't just hit him like that. You need to try a different tactic to damage him. Look at that archer hiding behind his friend like a wood. Switch to your arrows, douchebag. Snipe that little bitch. Sweet, now you can hit the guy in the back. Go for the pink mist. Yeah, bitch, that's what you get for fucking with the Wizard King. In your face! Careful, douchebag. That guy's ready for your arrows now. You gotta try something else.
Great job, douchebag. Kick their asses, new kid! I got you back! That didn't count! Let's do this, douchebag. Okay, that guy has a shield. Shields are super weak. Just hit them with your simplest hit over and over to wear them down quickly. That's Bush League. Just use your normal attack so you can hit him again. That guy's totally ready for you. Hit the shield guy. I don't think so. Oh, shut down. You do it. The other elf let his guard down. Now's your chance. Power attack his armor. That's it. Now finish him. Now. God. What? The stick of truth. The elves got it. That was your one goddamn job, Clyde! To guard the stick of fucking truth! Clyde, you are hereby banished from space and time! What? No! You can't do that! Yeah, I can! You're banished and lost in time and space! Yeah! Go home, Clyde! You fought bravely on the battlefield, douchebag. Yeah, if you can make me a douchebag, like you sure can't fight! Shut up, Scott. Nobody cares what you think. Anyways, we have a bigger problem now. The Stick of Truth has been stolen, and we must assemble our entire army in order to get it back. But our three best warriors still haven't reported for duty, my king. Our newest member can take care of that. Douchebag, I want you to go out into the neighborhood and find my greatest warriors, Token, Tweak, and Craig. I'm texting their pictures to your personal inventory device now. But beware. The lands outside are full of marauding drow elves, monsters, and sixth graders. Be sure you're well equipped. Now go, and send my warriors here. Fighters, go with him. So, guys, this is the end of part one of uh, Stick of Truth. You know, they last to play it. It was a bit laggy at first, but I've got the hang of it now. Yeah. So yeah, part two will be coming straight after. Still got, but probably upload this one straight away. So I hope you enjoyed it guys. Please like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next part. Goodbye.